Welcome, Bill Edstrom here. And in this video, I want to show you how to invoke Melodyne in Traction T7. Melodyne, with the ARA technology, was introduced back at the T5 version of Traction. It's really easy, but it's not necessarily obvious how you use it. So it works on audio clips, it allows you to do mostly pitch manipulation, but Melodyne does a lot more than that these days. So I'm gonna click on an audio clip and now, when you select an audio clip in properties, then you have the time stretching algorithm. Now, in T7, you may have this small view of the toolbar, in which case properties is available right here. And then you choose time stretch, and then at the bottom of the list, you'll see after the elastic options, you can choose Melodyne. So I'll go ahead and do that. And you'll see what happens is it then says Melodyne right in the middle of the clip. So when you click that, then you get the Melodyne ARA user interface. Now I'm using Melodyne Editor version 3. Traction comes with Melodyne Essential, which has some of the functionality. It's a reduced feature set. But in essence, you can click on these blobs and then make changes. So, so you could just take any of these notes, re-pitch them, or actually rewrite your melody, something like that. I'm not going to get into the details of how you use Melodyne. There's great resources on the Celimony website for that. So we'll go ahead and close that. So then how do you take Melodyne back out? Well, it's the same thing. You select the clip, go to Properties, and then change from Time Stretching Melodyne back to Time Stretch Elastic Pro, like this and that's how you take the Melodyne back off of the clip. So it's, it's really straightforward if you know the trick, and the trick is to select your clip, go to Properties, and switch from either No Time Stretching, Elastic Pro, or and then just select Melodyne. Melodyne appears in the center of the clip. You click that to open the UI, and it's also synchronized to the transport at that, air, at that time as well. You can see you can drag the transport from here, or you can drag it here, and it synchronizes between the two. So that's how you use Melodyne in Traction T7. To learn more about Traction, check out my book, Guide to Traction T7. It's available from leanpub.com. Go to leanpub.com, search for the word Traction, and you'll be able to pick up a copy. Thanks for watching.